Hi everybody, so in this video I'm going to be talking about how you can wipe your local DAISY server on PC, um, how you can get the um, uh, the XML files um, back to what they should be, so the vanilla ones, and also kind of a, a quick way of doing it. So let's start off with a quick way that I think you should sort of, if you run a server on your local PC, one of the quick ways of doing stuff. So when, when you download the server and you get, get it set up, don't use the DAISY server version. Keep that by itself and don't modify it or anything. And just copy it and call it a different name, like I've got DAISY server Chernerus. That way, one of the quickest ways you can just start again is just by um, uh, re renaming DAISY server to DAISY server Chernerus and then and just deleting the old version. So you've always got a fresh version ready. Um, next thing, if you want to wipe all the progress on your local server, um, so you want to get rid of um, you know, the characters and the bases and everything that's spawned in, especially if you're testing, say, new XML files, and you just want the... F it's, it's as though the server started again from new. What we need to do is we go into the server and you want to go into the missions uh, folder, find the particular mission you're running, and you want to go into the storage underscore one folder. And you just want to delete all of this. That way all the players' information will be gone, all the um, uh, all the spawn information will be gone, everything will be gone, and when, this, when the um, server starts again, it will be starting from fresh to do that. Um, finally, if you want to just put your um, XMLs back to vanilla um, and you you know you don't want to do the copy thing where you want to go is you want to go to Bohemia Interactive's uh, github repository and you go into here so Daisy Central Economy and you download here on this green button download zip and that will give you their um, vanilla files for Chernerus and Enoch and once you've downloaded it unzip it and you've got you've got all the XMLs there so you can just copy and paste them into your server to, to get them back to vanilla. So there we go, my friend. That is how you wipe your server. And uh, if you've got any questions, put them down below. If you've enjoyed the video, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. And I will see you again soon.